I've installed hundreds of EV chargers now, but I have no idea how they're made. So today, I'm gonna find out. I'm having a go at spraying a charger. Every single one of these chargers is painted by hand. This is Mandy Simpson, one of the owners of Simpson & Partners, and she is a design genius. All right, let's do it. So I hook this up. All right. To activate it, it's just the trigger on the bottom there. Okay. So you want to start just aiming below the unit yeah. and then bring it up at nice and speed when you're ready. Okay. Try and keep your fingers up to here if you can, because otherwise you'll take the paint off. Now we do our first inspection. What we're looking for here is any specks of dust, any lumps of paint where it might have got a bit thick. This is looking pretty good to me, nice and consistent. And inside here, we're just looking to make sure all the corners are filled in nicely, which they are. Done a really good job. So all we do now is do, we do the final pass. Exactly the same again, but slightly faster. One sweep for each purpose. Fantastic. Is that it? Yep. So then again, we're just going to find the section at this point. Make sure there's no defect. We're looking for any, any defects in the paint, any dust, particles, anything that needs to be on the Look at a nice easy finish, no build up powder, and this is looking really good. So inside as well, make sure all the extra field, you do catch the part, all filled nicely with paint. That's really good. Spot on. Follow me. Make sure you take your gloves off before your mask, or you're going to end up looking like this. The tour continued where we found out about every stage of the manufacturing process and how the colours are chosen for the chargers. Makes you wanna go. This is David Simpson, the other owner of the business, and this guy is a technical genius. This is the freestanding dual charger that can be used for single or three phase installations. The tour continued where we got to learn about all the different components, see the 3D printers in action, and gain some in-depth knowledge from David, who explained how all the components within the charger actually work. So that doesn't work in cycles, it's logic. So, Julian. Yes. What do we do? First of all, we've got the base. We've already silicon dipped for you. You take the LV and just place it inside. Okay, so this goes... That's it, just there? That's it, goes through the holder. That's it, yeah. Okay. And what's this part? That's the LV. That's the LV part there. Yeah, we need uh, four six millimeter screws. Is this magnetic? I'm not gonna drop no, this. No, they're not. Okay. Quite fiddly, this. It is. Um, we do use tweezers occasionally. Okay. okay. So next of all, we want the um, LED ribbon cable. Right, that one there. Yeah, and the same for the LV ribbon cable. Right, so that one that's there. Right. Yeah, that's right. And then the power clip goes into there. Inside the socket. Yeah, for this bit, I, I normally just place it like that. Yeah, and the inside, on it. Oh, that way. Sorry, yeah, yeah. I'm fairly special, as you can see, in there. That's it, yeah. Sorry. That's all right. And then is it the M8s? Yes, M8s, five of those. So every single one of these is made to order. So when you buy one of these chargers, this is exactly what happens. This is the RCM. Yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Around that stanchion. Green and yellow one. What around the back? Underneath? What? Yeah. And then this goes. Just goes through there. How quickly can you do this? Five minutes? Yeah. I'm doing well then. Yeah, you're doing well then. And then we just, just took that one behind, stanch it that way. What we're gonna do now is get the HV, HV, sorry. Right. And sit that on the top. So that goes, is that ribbon, have I done that, that right? Yes, right, that's just, gonna bend just, over the top and 
All sit right. in it. Still last. Lost that one. I'll just shake out the ones after that I drop. Yeah. Have we got any three? Oh, we've got them there. I'm not very good at this, Chaz. Yeah, absolutely. Obviously, it is. I'm not sure. I'm not... I, think, I think we're good. Yeah. That's up there. The blue one. Yeah. That doesn't go through, that just goes straight into it. And then the green and yellow. Yeah, through there. Through it. And, it's nice. and then we use the, the white pen just to mark the ends of it so that we've tightened them. Just here? Yeah. Just a little, what, a little dash? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. And that's that. It just needs to be tested now. There we go. Built a charger. <laughs> Carly's gonna test this, but this is secret. Now we get to choose the color of my lid and the front. I thought, you've got that green down there, haven't you? And it's, so that green down there sort of matches my logo-ish. Yeah. I think that matched the logo. Oh, definitely, yeah? Yes. yeah? Right, going for the green and then lid, what do you reckon? What would you normally have with that wood? And what color do you reckon? That looks nice, doesn't it? This is Chaz who invited me here today. Absolute legend. I quite like that, it's nice, isn't it? I go for that. Okay, so the, this lid attaches to here. That's that it. way. That's it. Is that the rain? <clears throat> this is nice, because normally I'm in that. Right. Next stage, put that on here. And we've got the metal bit. Over. That's it. Like that. Just two of these. Du, 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 du. I do this sometimes and I think if I turn that on. The amount of times I film stuff <laughs> yes. and it ain't been on. Because there used to be something there. That one? That one there. <laughs> Goes into that. That's it. Because mm -hmm. I never take this actually back out. No. I thought it's very difficult to get out once it's tin. How do you even get it in in the first place? So you've got to hold it and then just screw it down. Oh, right, you fed it through. Yeah. Right, understood. There we go. Lovely. Right. And the finishing touch. So this is going to go that that's, way. That's it, yeah. That way. That way, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry you know. God. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know me ups and downs. Oh, nearly. Right. There we go. And then you need two more of the black screws. Black ones. Starts off in the little hole and it should go straight down into, into the little hole. Yeah. Finally, it's going out to a customer. Yeah. We use the spray just to give it a quick wipe over. This one? Yeah. What on the metal, the word, everything? Metal, yeah, yeah. yeah. Professional cleaner. Goes in the box. And then that goes in there. Oh, it's, it's them pre-folds there? Yeah. Got ya. That way. That way. No. That way. <laughs> so it's the installer pack, the cards, which you give to the customer. That's the customers. Yes. Everything I've done today, I've made look really difficult. We just close that one first. So that and they go through there. Yeah. And then that. Those on top, that's it. And then, and then we're there. There we have a state-of-the-art Simpsons EV charging point. It's super windy, but hopefully you can hear me. I have been to loads of trade shows and different sort of trade events. And this has hands down, without a doubt, been the best one I've ever been to. After coming here today, if I'm honest, the effort that goes in and this business, how good it is and how good the products are made, this charger is worth a lot more. I can promise you that. I'm absolutely inspired by the people that run this business. Dave and Mandy, brilliant people. I'm 
absolutely love it. I'm going home. See you next week. Subscribe to my channel.